was crypto muscle coming to you another YouTube video. Here we are in actually now worldwide. In case other words at crypto muscle and the crypto muscle network. Come to you in this video. Uh, this video is going to be a big update because I'm going to be covering um, several platforms. Uh, so we'll call it crypto chaos continuum, right? Because um, you know it's chaos in crypto, as always. Uh, liquidations are happening in the market when it comes to Bitcoin and trading and all that. Right when you think it's going up, you know, it hit $45,000. Next thing you know, liquidation because now it's dumped back down to like 42 ish. And, uh, you know, it's just, it's crypto. It's crazy. It's chaos. And so with uh, these platforms, uh, I'm going to be covering, like I said, several platforms because a lot of things are happening um, within the next, you know, day or two. So uh, we're going to talk about it now, and then we're going to talk about it on the other side of all this uh, once everything kind of settles down, the dust settles and all that good stuff. So uh, it's early morning hours right now um, for Thursday the 4th. So obviously uh, they didn't give a time yet as to this relaunch of Quopi. So we're going to see... <laughs> All right, if this thing's going to come back online, if it's going to be available, if it's just going to be one of those things where they say, oh, you got to pay to withdraw and all this other stuff, we're going to see. All right, um, or the, if they're going to push this back, who knows? Um, but we're here right now, and I'm going to monitor this as the day goes along, and uh, we'll see what happens with Quopi. All right, so I thought I'd kick it off today with this. And uh, we're going to talk about several platforms, like I said, the legacies, um, mid-levels, all that good stuff. Good, bad, could be ugly. <laughs> all right. So uh, let's talk about it, all right? Um, yeah, so that's Quopi. All right. Now let's talk about, let's see here, Infinity X. How about that? We'll go into Infinity X. Uh, if I could find it, other oh, nope, that's not it. <laughs> I gotta find it. Man, it was just like right in my face, and all of a sudden I can't find it. There we go. So now, um, Infinity X, as you can see, has officially been launched. So, um, you know, everything's gonna be converting over. And it's already begun, right? Infinity X, price recovery is already starting to happen. 0 0.78, uh, or sorry, 78 cents. So it's it's already off to a better start because it was, what, 5 cents when it all ended? So um, they're, they're, they put some things in place so that way there wouldn't be that crazy drop-off and downfall once again, all right? And so... It's all about um, just reconnecting and then uh, kind of just reestablishing yourself with uh, utilizing these miners and, and the selling of, you know. So if you're sharing the opportunity, uh, that's the best way to go about with Infinity X is to sell the opportunity um, and to showcase what you get out of it and um, take it from there, right? 78 cents. And uh, we'll see what happens, you know. Um, let's see. So, so far I've earned $72, or 72 pi, sorry. 72 pi X coins. And so, right now, I'm just kind of letting it ride, right? That's what I did last time. I just let it ride. I went about it that way. Uh, it says that I have this 1.0 balance of 1500 That uh, says deposit, view details. So I think that's what's being utilized um, out there. And the only way I could kind of get ahead of earning in this area to maximize it is, you know, well, to get more miners in action. And it's all about if, if people are interested in obtaining these miners for yourself, right? 100-unit 100, 100 miner. 500 units, 1,000, 2,000, 5,000, 10,000. And that's, you know, dollars, right, that you're spending into a plan. All right, so it says that because I already have one in action, which is the 5,000 
miner uh, in action. So, you know, uh, will there be a recovery to the promised land of the, you know, six dollar ish? I think it was around close to six bucks uh, the last go around. And, you know, they look like they're trying to get things going the right way. They could have just packed up and said, you know, what, we're done. But they're trying to make things right and trying to make it in, you know, intended to what it was. All right. So I like what they're doing. I, I, I think that they're, they're trying to steer things in the positive direction. And uh, it's really shown right now because it's now it's already at 78 cents. And it's still just early beginnings of the new Infinity X. So check that out. Let me know what you think about that. And um, it, it's really to your benefit to join in now if you're new. Because if you are if you were in this thing when it was Infinity Pi, uh, you know, we got work to do in order to, to benefit uh, from it versus new people that's coming in right now. Because the new people that are coming in that's better benefiting from this, especially in daily earnings, um, is better now than, you know, us existing already in the system. So um, that's how you got to look at it. And uh, yeah, and, and I talked about it in my last Infin Infinity Pi slash X video. If you looked at that video a few days ago, uh, I explained the new process, how it works, blah, 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 blah. And, um, you know, and I, that's courtesy of uh, Queen Wiki, by the way. She uh, gave out a pretty thorough, short, but thorough update on how everything's supposed to work. And uh, it was, you know, very easy to listen to versus trying to listen through a whole presentation of it. Um, and so, yeah, that's what happened there. So that's Infinity X for you, all right? So I just want to give you guys an update on that. Now let's take a look over at my DH Live because big things are happening on my DH Live. What I want to do first is I haven't done anything in terms of withdrawals ever in this platform. See total withdrawal zero. So I thought, you know what, I'm going to take advantage of doing a withdrawal now because um, I, don't know, I just haven't had that opportunity. Uh, I've been letting it ride, letting it ride, and I feel like my time is now in terms of just getting one in so you can see they process withdraws oh Mondays and Tuesdays huh hmm let's see what is today Wednesday oh all right well never mind maybe I gotta wait <laughs> so they process so if I put one in now let me see what happens all right please allow 48 hours for your withdrawal request to be processed and you know what I'll just put one in and then um, you know we'll just let it see what happens you know let it play out and uh, go from there so they take a fee of 5.5 percent got to do what you got to do uh, let me see if they let me put my receiving address give me one sec and uh, go from there. So I've been so I submitted it, all right. And with that, um, yeah, all right. There we go. You know what? Let me re let me change that up. I think there's a membership. Uh, section there yeah let me make an adjustment on that just to kind of make sure it's good because um let me see what membership payments are okay no records i don't know if there's a membership payment i thought i read something around there there's like a membership payment so i'll just i'll put in um 2700 that way i'll give me a little bit of a cushion in terms of um, you know th that all right so that way uh, I'll give me 2500 right so yeah that way it'll give me a little bit of a cushion in terms of um, the what I get out of it so 
That way, uh, let's see. I'll, I'll give myself at least 500 back in there. So I'll do that. Yeah, so that'll give me at least 500 in the wallet. You know, just just in case there's a membership. Because I thought I might have read somewhere that there was a membership uh, sort of thing I, I got to stay on top of uh, in order to keep my DH life going. So the reason why I'm talking about my DH life is because uh, we're on a cusp of a January 5th deadline. I want to give you guys an update on that. Uh, so let me get into that right now. I got to pull up my emails. Give me one sec. All right, so there's a series. Uh, there's two emails I wanted to share with you guys, and this is all just in the last couple of days. All right, so January 5th, they're launching uh, my DH Life launch. All right, so we've been kind of waiting for this for a few months now, and uh, we've been in this thing for a little while in pre-launch. All right, so we got the pre-launch opportunity for those of you that went in with me early. You know, because I'm always trying to find these opportunities. So you can lock in your current reward points. So your the current reward program remains in place until January 5th. So this is your last chance to secure those reward points without any additional requirements. So you can unlock seven additional levels by subscribing to their marketing system. Uh, you can unlock seven additional commission levels, all right? So commission en enhancements. Uh, they're thrilled to announce in 2024 uh, of the next half well, is the next having, and they've already witnessed a s significant growth from a low of 26,654. Our value has surged to 45,485, a mark of 62% increase in just one quarter, and that's just the beginning. Um, so you have that. All right, so the fifth is coming. All right, we're just a day away. All right, so here's this, all right. Uh, the next update, which is now yesterday. Uh, you can maximize your current reward points, unlock seven levels, uh, position for commis commission enhancements, because starting on January 5th, they're rolling out exciting commission enhancements. Get ready to take full advantage of these enhancements and watch your earnings soar. Access the marketing system to leverage uh, seven additional levels and that um, they're going to have a webinar, overview webinar, to kind of talk about things. And um, they have two sessions. It's going to be uh, later on this morning at 9 a.m. And they're going to have another one at 6 p.m. This is West Coast time. So just a couple hours away, and then you're going to see the first webinar at 9 a.m. And they have a link for that, all right? And there's also one more email I wanted to share. So those of you that's been in, look at this one. This one came up. Happy birthday, crypto. All right, so today's your birthday, which is not my birthday, but um, but I guess it's January 1st dated here. So, and it's not my birthday. I'm telling you that right now. It's not my birthday. Um, so on behalf of my DH life, oh, I know why. Because I think they asked for a birth date uh, when you put in uh, the registration part. So I just put one one two thousand. I think is what I put. You know the millennium. <laughs> uh, I think that's what I put. So we would like to celebrate you with a two hundred dollar travel and dining pass. So click here to redeem it. Okay. Let me see what that's looking like. Wow. Okay. So here's the here's this again. Um, so this is stuff I could redeem, all right? Yeah, this, this is part of my package that I bought. So I could redeem uh, airfare, two nights hotel. Or I could redeem four night cruise. Four night Mexico resort. Uh, all inclusive resort here. Uh, $200 travel and dining pass. Four night cruise, another one. That's for the kingdom pass, see that? Or the Kingdom package I got. Uh, seven night resort family. So there's, there's look, look at all these certificates I could claim. All right. Pretty good stuff. And so if you're wondering what I'm talking about, let me show you what I'm talking about here. Uh, package, right? So these are the packages. Earl, 
uh, prince, king, and kingdom. All right, and that's the biggest package is $2,500 kingdom. And I think there's a limit of uh, up to, this is $2,500. I think you could limit, um, I think by leveraging up to $25,000 total. All right, so uh, I just got this one because you get the full package, everything. That's why I got this one. If you guys watch my launch video and the video I just kept playing over and over and over. Because uh, I, I just thought it was a good way to kind of reinforce my DH life and what it's about. Is because I kind of just went through it and what I did. And um, I thought that was the best complete package of what you get out of it. And so that's why I went with the kingdom. And uh, I think that's the best deal of all. But. Any one of these you win anyways. Is, I mean, because they all come with a four-night Mexico resort as a beginner right here. Right? Uh, you get four-night Mexico resort. All includes a resort certificate, right, for that one. So when it comes to including that stuff, that's already paying off the ticket here because look at it. Seven-night resort family of four. All-inclusive resort certificate. Four-night Mexico resort. I mean, all just that alone already covers that and then when, of course when you get the full shebang I mean you're getting all those resort stuff airfare cruise uh, conference if you want to go to the conference and uh, the DH life annual dinner as well I mean all that stuff kind of really covers the $2,500 you know that's why I thought it's a great opportunity to share this thing and uh, they have all these different lifestyle products, which is education and simply uh, lifestyle uh, stuff that you can do for yourself. Besides education, they have global causes too. You know, if you want to kind of contribute to some sort of, um, you know, I guess a cause, right? Uh, to make situations better in other places. And then, of course, here's the marketing part. All right, so you can unlock and open up seven more levels. So a lot of good stuff here. That's why I kept sharing this thing over and over and over, you know, like now it's gonna officially launch tomorrow. So if you wanna get in, because I think the points of what you get uh, for My DH Life, let me see if I can find My DH Life real quick. Because there's some stuff said that I thought um, really tells some good things here. Uh, let's see. As long as your withdrawal request is in before Saturday midnight, it'll be processed in the following week, regardless of what day you submit it. So, so uh, I did it today. Today's Thursday. And it's going to be processed because I'm doing it before Saturday midnight, obviously. And then it gets processed Monday. So that's what it meant when it said that it processes Monday. And up to 48 hours after that, you should get it by Wednesday midnight. So there you go. So we're going to see if that comes through and hits the wallet by then. And also, you can see that there, the point changes that are coming into effect. Uh, today is where it's at now versus tomorrow when it changes. So you can see here, uh, the point system changes on January 5th. If you join before the 5th, as in today, you get 300 points with a $100 package. Points represent pretty much dollars. Uh, 1,500 points with $500, 3,000 points with $1,000, 7,500 points with $2,500. Purchase once, Get points as time passes, each worth $1. So that's what I mean. Point is a dollar. Buy $100 buys, get $300 over time. Better than your bank. No qualifications now. A pass is to match it January 5th. Qualif qualifications kick in. And thus, <laughs> I kept saying, <laughs> this is the time to do it. All this pre-launch time. All right. So my $2,500 I put in. I'm going to earn until it hits $7,500, 7,500 points or dollars, however you want to call it, because that's what I put myself into, all right? Um, so, just saying, 
you want to take advantage of that, you better get in today since today is kind of the deadline day to do it. All right, because by then, it's all going to change. You're going to have to hit qualifications starting the 5th on. But they also said they enhanced the commission system too. So who knows if it's going to be more lucrative. Obviously, it seems like it is. They, they sound like it is. So uh, it's very interesting how it's going to be. But I, I wanted to share this with you guys, all right, because this is the last day to take advantage of uh, pretty much uh, tripling your points on uh, what you purchase. So $2,500 package like I did will get you 7,500 points or $7,500 returned. All right. So not only will you get all these you know, bonuses that you get here, but you're going to get back $7,500 over time from 2500 I mean, pfft, that's a no-brainer. It's a win. All right? That's why I kept saying this is a, definitely a legacy. And now, tomorrow, it officially launches, too. I mean, that's crazy. All right, so that's uh, my DH life. What else is going on out there right now? Um, just a couple more things I wanted to cover. Uh, I guess I'll just cover it because it's still something I want to just bring attention to. And uh, I don't know if it's going to go anywhere or not, but we'll see. And that's uh, Let's Mine. All right. Uh, Let's Mine. I just have a very sensitive, uh, what do you call that? Mal- what is, I don't know what they call this. Malware bites? Yeah. Very sensitive. Uh, Let's Mine, all right. It's still trying to get its thing going, so um, I haven't shared a link yet because I'm still trying to see if they're going to fix everything, but I just wanted to mention that. That's all. <laughs> so that's less mine. Um, what was another thing? Oh, all right. Let's talk about Vindrac. All right. So I've seen two things. All right. Vindrac is a program where you can earn 1.8% daily. And, um, you know, across time, all right, let me see here if it shows, all right, already logged out, that's fine. So you can earn 1.8% daily for 30 days and 100% capital return or 2.3%, and it all depends on what you deposit. So I've been seeing some things out there, and I, and I wanted to kind of look at it both ways, all right? Um... It's been said that they stopped paying, right? Another YouTuber said it stopped paying. He commented in my comments. Um, but on the other hand, it does say give up to 48 hours, uh, you know, in terms of withdraw. So I did conduct a withdraw because that got my attention. And I want to see if it's going to follow through and pay. So we'll give this thing a 48 hour window to see if it's going to come through on a withdrawal. And if it doesn't, then uh, I'll make note of that and let you guys know that, all right, these guys are done. But I'm going to be very cautious right now with it. I'll remove my link all right now, today, all right, in lieu of this 48-hour uh, window that's going to be happening. And um, we'll see in 48 hours. And if it pays uh, well within that time frame, I'll put it back up. And I'll tell you guys that too. Uh, either way, I'm going to remove my link anyways just because um, the other U- the YouTuber that mentioned it. Um, let's see if he's here. Oh, this this guy. He calls himself The Journey. He has more subs too. He has like 17k subs. He said that they rugged, alright? So, hey, I'm just saying, you know, I, I acknowledge everything, alright? So, thank you for sharing that. And uh, I'll see, you know. I'll, I'll take note of that and I'll see... But I also want to show proof of that too, all right? So I conducted a withdrawal. It was just 54 bucks. We'll see if that happens. So that's Vindrac. I'm going to remove the link just to be safe, all right? And if it's paying, then I'll put it back up. Um, and so with that, let's talk about another one, all right? This is another one that caught my attention today. Or not today, uh, yesterday. Uh, yesterday night, actually. Caught my attention. Oh, here it goes. Here's DepFX. All right, I'm going to log in right now. All right, so DepFX. Um, let me go back to the front real quick. 
So we know what they're about. I've talked about these guys, uh, th I think, three videos so far on them. They say they do instant withdrawals. You can see that there. You can earn between 4 to 8% daily, depending on the plan you go into, all that stuff, right? So I just wanted to give you guys the background. Now, what caught my attention is Telegram groups, right? That's what I love about Telegram groups that accompany platforms. Um, their group has been closed since the morning of yesterday. So that caught my attention. I was like, oh, okay. If that's the case, something might be up here. And so uh, what I want to do is I want to pull a withdrawal right now. And then uh, we'll see what happens there. All right. Um, let me see. Yeah. It says balance $63. So we'll see. We're going to pull this off right now. I can't do nothing. I don't know about Doge, but $60.99. All right. And if this comes through, I'll be, uh, you know, I'll I'll just be like, okay, then they're still doing this thing, you know, and I stand corrected. But a closed Telegram group is usually a good indicator to that something's up because if they don't know anything, they just all of a sudden close it, then something's up with that, you know. So and yeah, so they don't even do. Um, because what they were doing before when they were paying was they would do a short uh, hashtag or hash ID, which was not instantaneous. It instant, but not instantaneous. It would pay. Um, but that right there is already telling that, yeah, closed Telegram group, that by saving is done. All right. So DepFX done. I'll remove, I'll remove that link. Uh, and then Vindrak, I'm, I'm going to play it safe and remove that link as well. So, could those be dead? Oh, yeah, probably. All right, so uh, lastly, Echo 1, all right? So, I want to give you guys an Echo 1 update. Because if you guys are wondering what happened with Echo 1, you know, like, did it, did it follow through? Did anything happen, all right? So that's what I wanted to do. All right, let's go to the Telegram group of Echo One, and there's we're gonna see right what happened here. Uh, let's see here. I wanted to give you guys an update. All right, I didn't I didn't do a video because I started to see. Um, I wanted to see if they were going to open up the withdrawal. Shit, I keep on pulling up the wrong one here. There we go, official. All right, so here we go. This was posted uh, yesterday afternoon, all right? So, uh, let's see, withdrawal delay explanation. So, they were supposed to open up 6 p.m. UTC time. So, what does that mean? Uh, well, in my time, it would be 10 a.m., uh, Pacific time, my my time, right? So they posted this at 3.44 p.m. yesterday. So you're looking at roughly uh, 11, 12, 1, 2, 3, almost six hours later, right? Almost six hours later, this is what was explained here. There's an explanation delay here. Uh, we want to extend our sincere apologies for the delay in processing withdrawals today. We understand that timely withdrawals are crucial to you and we're here to provide explanation and assurance. The delay was caused by our exchange withdrawal taking longer than expected to transfer funds to our withdrawal server, the platform from which you make your withdrawals. We want to assure you that as soon as the funds arrive, we will promptly initiate the withdrawal process. So regarding that 24 hour notice, uh, as soon as it opens up, that's when the 24 hour time window begins um, so obviously it hasn't opened up yet at the time of this video uh, we understand that recent events in crypto have raised concerns about rug pulls and scams we want to assure you that your funds are safe with us your trust of utmost importance and we're committed to maintaining the highest security standards uh, you don't need to contact your upline for status updates They'll post in Telegram when it is available. So as of the time of this video, it's not available. 
Uh, they they are blah blah blah. Make it all right. Now let's go to the group, the chat group. All right. So let's see here, the chat group. And so the way it works is, uh, when it comes to being inside Echo One, you know what? Let's go inside. All right, so this is what it's looking like inside Echo One's uh, back office. So when you do a withdraw, it will show up here. Now, obviously, the withdraw is not there, so that means it's not available at the time of this video. By the time you watch the video, it could be up now, you know. Um, but you, this is the according to the server time right now. As you can see, that's the time right now. By the time you watch the video, obviously, it's going to be a different server time. It could be open. I think at this point, shit, it's already Thursday. Might as well just wait till the weekend, right? They're supposed to open up withdrawals again on Saturdays and Sundays per usual. I'd just wait till the weekend, if anything. I'll give them that benefit of the doubt. I'm not going to put no pressure on Echo 1 to have it open for a 24-hour window when they're just going to open back up, shit, on the weekend. What? I mean, might as well just wait till Saturday, Sunday and and uh, see if they'll get it together that way, right? Uh, that's the way I'm looking at it. And um, that's fine. And I'm good with that. So we'll see what happens with Echo 1. And we all know that recently they changed to Litecoin withdraws, which is unusual, but shit, I'll do it. I'll take it. That's fine with me. Uh, you know, I, I welcome that, actually. So um, that's the latest about what we got going on, all right, uh, with Echo 1. At the time of this video, it's not open yet. Still, I'd say just wait till the weekend, if you ask me. Give them the benefit of the doubt to the weekend and see how that goes. All right, so let's see what the chat is looking like here. You got this little dick bag right here. This little conniving little dick bag. He thinks he's fucking cool, but he's not. He's a little trash piece of shit, all right? That's all I got to say about him. Um, they, you know, he always likes to chime in on some and, and just talk like he knows everything and he really doesn't he's just trash all right so let's see here they cannot enable the withdraw button until there is money on the payment server try to understand they are trying to withdraw trading profits from the exchange the echo one payment server and then from there the withdraw button can be enabled so that people can withdraw so oh sh please settle down uh you don't go enabling a withdrawal button when the money is not in the server. Oh, 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 oh my gosh, man. Shut the fuck up. <laughs> you know what I mean? This this dick bag, you know, if you listen to his shit, he talked about how he put $30,000 of his own money in there, which is, he's lying. Uh, he talked about how he's been talking with these guys for several months before they launched the platform. It's like, no, you are nowhere to be seen, buddy, because I was in this thing at the beginning of its pre-launch. And you were not nowhere to be seen at all, buddy. So, you know, it's, it's the shit he fucking lies about all the time. And I'll fucking rip on him till the cow go, goes home, you know. And he, he's, he's a traitor to the U.S. because he's from the U.S. And he always tries to market his stuff uh, and try to act like, this is not intended for, you know, U.S. and Canada, man. Shut the fuck up, you know. And shit like that. Like, nerd-ass, piece of shit, trash. Him and his little... Bitch ass partner Don Malachy, which you can't even understand a word that he's saying coming out of his mouth. Then you got his dumb ass girlfriend that she thinks she's like the hottest thing ever and that she's the smartest thing ever and that she knows it all and she she she's like the goddess in crypto. Shut the fuck up too. She's a bitch too. And so when you put all that a combination of dick bags together, um <laughs> well that's what you get. You get these people that is you know, they're here one minute. And when shit is the fan, no content whatsoever. All right. And yet, there's been no content from him ever since they changed to Litecoin, which is kind of uh, interesting because he's the one that kept pushing and harping on the idea. Oh, it's instant Bitcoin. And oh, yeah, we talked about how, you know, we limit to withdrawals on the weekends. Like, like he acts like he's been part of this thing and that he suggested all this stuff because, by the way, I was around when you just did all the stupid stuff in other platforms and ruined it with you and your other buddy Jan, all right? And he's trying to act like they worked on things to help better improve and better stand out above past platforms and all that. You know why? Because he fucked up the other platforms in the past with the multiple withdrawals and all that stuff, you know? And uh, people don't forget, you know? I don't forget. I'm a purveyor of history. 
And uh, what else is there on top of all that? Besides that, right? <laughs> all right, get this. Uh, it, it's funny. So besides the fake deposit, because he's a he's a bitch. He would never put $30,000 of his own money because he's a bitch like that. Uh, that's one. Two, the multiple withdrawal stuff, he fucked up other platforms because of that. And so for him to say that, he suggested it. No, he, 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 he's the one that kind of laid the landscape and changed crypto. I mean, the Wonder Echo one decided, you know what? We better go change the Litecoin or something, you know? That way we could prevent this whole Bitcoin uh, multiple pullout stuff happening. And they got to pay an exorbitant amount of fees because Bitcoin's on, been on the rise. And they don't want dick bags like the markers of the world to fuck it up. So that's why they went to Litecoin. All right. And then the third one that I wanted to bring up too is um, besides multiple withdrawal issues, the fake deposit that he's so full of shit about. Uh, the third thing I wanted to bring up was that, you know, he keeps on saying that he brings up these ideas. He's the one that's talked to the people behind it. All I got to say is, uh, you know, it's, it's funny how every time you're involved in something that, you act like you're behind the scenes, that you, you talk all this shit, but yet you were nowhere, buddy. All right? Nowhere. Zero. Zilch. I was there. I was I was there. I was there in Vortec. You were not around uh, at least a month till, you know, after I was in it. Echo 1, I, I would say it was about the same timeline. You weren't around till about a month after pre-launch that uh i you know after me before you showed up and acted like you've been a part of it and yet you've been you've been in the conversation for a long time it's funny how that is shit i mean we could go back to other platforms cloud nowhere to be seen i was there all right in the very beginning very very beginning before you were to be seen pegasus same shit nowhere to be seen nowhere to be found all right, and the one thing that his M.O. has been, that dickbag Marcos, all right, bitch, is that when shit hits the fan, man, those videos come down, and he, he pulls that disappearing act. All right, uh, let's see if he pulled any videos down recently. Let's see here, because he's a little bitch like that. All right, we're going to see here. I'm surprised he hasn't really uh, bought his views because, you know, how these views went viral, right? 15,000, 15,000, 16,000. Uh, he was consistent with that, but all of a sudden he stopped being consistent with that and showed his true colors. See, this is the true colors right here. Whereas these right here, these videos are not any different than what he's been playing here. So all I got to say is, yeah, uh, you fooled nobody, buddy. Just like this 35k subs, fake. All right, he was riding on what maybe 2k subs early early last year, and to rise like that, uh, no, don't buy it. I don't buy it all, except he bought the subs. I mean, that's the only thing you could buy. All right, so um, guaranteed to be a straight bitch. All right, and being the straight bitch that he is, guaranteed in every platform. Once it fails, videos come down disappearing at you won't see him for a while and then something emerges he'll be back again i mean that's just the way it is so just want to give you guys an update on echo one all right be care be careful of the bitches out there all right douchebags dick bags bitches oh that that's all defines marcos <laughs> and uh echo one all right as of right now it's not opened up yet so it's all good and uh recent conversation um yeah so kind of waiting to see what happens there you saw the official post um i don't know i just don't feel like they're gonna go down just yet i, I still think they got time and uh you know there's a platform like this that needs to be out there right now and i don't feel like they are in that mode to go down just yet all right that's just my straight up thoughts on it i mean uh, I, I didn't. I don't foresee the signs of it going down as of right now. I just. I just don't. Um, I could be wrong. I'm not guaranteeing nothing. I could be wrong. I could just be 
totally wrong about what my thoughts are and uh you know and then they're, they're gone after that you know um but i don't know i just don't feel like it's their time to go just yet all right so um you know we're to keep an eye on this and uh well like i said after today we're going to be on the other side of all the platforms that i mentioned because january 4th 5th is some uh, something pivotal about those dates with many platforms um that are happening right now so you know it's just funny um how that is all right and here's a preview of something that uh, i really wanted to kind of mention this is a preview of something that's coming all right boom what's this <laughs> all right what's this what is it it's earn.world all right so uh, i'll just throw it mention it as that earn.world uh, i'm going to go into this more i think this is going to be a, a good one and this is pre-launch right now but i'm going to go into more details about it it's pre-launch february is when it launches uh this could be a new legacy the people that are involved is pretty deep and um and we always welcome the legacies out there so that's everything you need to know that's your latest update on 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 everything we got going on here and um other than that like i said we'll see you on the other side of this as uh you know crypto is is uh crazy right it's the chaos that we are within comment down below links down below for everything and i'll see you next one